Behold, the world's first most gigantic and technologically advanced four-dimensional spherical structure on the planet is set to open on September 29th, 2023 with a deafening concert by the band U2. The $2.3 billion MSG sphere at the Venetian Resort in Las Vegas is like no other structure in existence with an exterior that features millions of unique LED lights spanning 54,000 square meters, allowing it to appear like anything programmers want it to be, such as a Halloween pumpkin, planet Earth, Mars, or an alien spaceship. The interior of the sphere is a colossal, high-definition, 16K by 16K resolution wraparound LED screen, measuring a mind-numbing 15,000 square meters. It covers almost the entire interior's curved walls and roof, turning it into a real-life metaverse. In fact, it is more intriguing than being inside a metaverse because it features 4D effects such as wind, scents, and climate controls that magnify the experience of the custom-made shows on the giant screen. And as if all that was not enough, you can also use virtual reality goggles in some of the shows, which needless to say, will make one feel 100% immersed in the experience. What is the MSG Sphere? How was it built? And what are the superior technologies used to make it something straight out of this world? The MSG Sphere is a futuristic, one-of-a-kind, 112 meters high and 157 meters wide entertainment venue that was designed by Populous, a renowned global architectural and design firm specializing in sports facilities, arenas, and convention centers. The project is owned by the Madison Square Garden Company and Apollo Global Management. Initially, it was supposed to cost $1.2 billion. However, its budget has exceeded $2 billion and the final budget is estimated to be around $2.4 billion. This will make it the most expensive entertainment venue in Las Vegas history, beating out the $1.9 billion Allegiant Stadium. The most important feature of this amazing structure is its interior, which includes the world's largest ultra-high-resolution LED screen that will display daily unique shows that are custom-made exclusively for such a colossal behemoth screen that engulfed the entire interior of the sphere. Naturally, a screen of such proportions required the opening of specialized studios to create custom cutting-edge shows. In mid-2022, MSG Sphere Studios opened in Burbank, California to handle the production and post-production work for the MSG Sphere in Las Vegas. Of course, such an endeavor required collaboration with filmmakers and musicians to create some of the content. Ted King, who previously worked on Star Trek The Experience, is among those who will create visual content for the sphere. The studio will also produce content in association with the 2023 Las Vegas Grand Prix and Formula One, which will travel past and or around the sphere. Believe it or not, to make this possible, the company designed the California studio as a 100 feet tall sphere in order to effectively test the technology and content. The interior will feature 18,600 seats on nine different levels. The seating configuration is also unique and allows the venue to be used for all sorts of purposes, such as concerts and award shows. In fact, the entire venue is built with flexibility in mind. As a result, more than one event can take place simultaneously without interruptions. You can expect a dizzying, immersive experience that you can even further enhance by using virtual reality goggles. Mind you that you probably would not need them since they are using state-of-the-art 4D technologies. 4D technologies are designed to turn 3D technologies into the whole real thing by exposing people to elements of nature such as wind, fog, climate changes such as an increase in temperature, and even rain. Additionally, the seats are designed to automatically move and vibrate as the show dictates and in conjugation with sound vibrations. This actually makes us think that the whole sphere is designed as one monstrous advanced simulator. Naturally, such a venue with such a mesmerizing interior meant that the exterior cannot be left plain like an eyesore. So the designers turned the exterior into a massive screen using millions of programmable LED lights. 
The exterior acts as a massive round 360 degree screen that people can see from miles away. It is designed to feature interactive commercials and other shows for advertising or event announcement purposes or just fun stuff by depicting things such as a Christmas snow globe or anything creative that crosses the programmer's mind, including Humpty Dumpty, I guess. About one third of the interior has been dedicated to a stage for the many already scheduled concerts and award shows. Even though the venue is not designed to host sporting events, it still can be utilized for hosting boxing and mixed martial arts matches, as well as esports tournaments. Just imagine a millionaire renting the whole sphere for a couple of hours just to connect to his PlayStation 5, put on his VR goggles, and play Street Fighter VI. As for sound quality, well, the notorious Berlin-based audio company Holopot has installed a spatial audio system using as many as 164,000 speakers inside the sphere, with a focus on delivering unparalleled, deafening, crystal clear sound quality. A 300 meters long pedestrian bridge will connect the sphere to the expo, and there are plans to build a new Las Vegas monorail station to serve the sphere and the Venetian. As you can guess, turning such a monstrous structure into something technologically advanced required the use of some ancient and postmodern science and a harmonious infusion of epic design. For example, they used the finite element method in creating computer models of key structures across the venue. Geodesic math was used to make the sphere's exoskeleton. One can clearly see how hundreds of interlocking triangles create the 360 degree shape and structure. They even used Pi to define things, such as the exact location of the best seat in the house. Visual acuity was also utilized to calculate how many pixels it would take to display images in ultra-high resolution. Let's now take a look at the engineering and construction processes that resulted in this awesome structure. The excavation for the basement and foundations of the MSG sphere began in 2019. Nearly 84,000 cubic meters of dirt were removed to prepare the site. Contrary to what you might think, the basement is designed to hold major events and features some retail space, bars, and of course, some gambling tables and slots. The world's fourth largest crane, a Demag CC8800 crawler crane, was brought over from Belgium and then set up on the site's northeast side for the purpose of lifting the numerous heavy construction materials. In October 2020, crews completed the heaviest lift with the installation of two 240-ton steel girders. A few months later, a 170-ton steel compression ring was added. The dome's roof required 3,000 tons of steel in the form of 32 trusses, each one weighing 100 tons. Truss installation reached the midway point in May 2021, and the crane had to be moved to the southern side of the property to install the remainder. Upon completion, of the roof's steel frame, 4,600 cubic meters of concrete were pumped onto the roof. This formed a layer measuring 10 inches in thickness and weighing approximately 10,000 tons. In June 2022, construction of the external exosphere began. This exosphere was built by connected super heavy triangular trusses around the dome. The crews then turned their focus to the 730 ton steel interior frame that is designed to support the LED screens and audio system. Then the installation of the interior and exterior LED screens was completed. In July 2023, the sphere's exosphere, which is made of 1.2 million pucks that each contain 48 individual LED lights that can display 256 million different colors fired up to dazzle the audiences. Several elevators, staircases, and escalators lead to the various seating levels. The large hollow area below hosts a museum, retail outlets, restaurants, and other amenities to entertain the guests. Technically speaking, there are no bad seats in the MSG sphere during shows on the big screen. However, the lower level seats would be the closest to the stage during concerts. So, are you going to Vegas anytime soon to check out this world wonder? And what are your expectations? Let us know in the comments section and please do like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. Thank you.